So, you want to be a voice actor, and you have no doubt had a recording ruined by this sound. Hello. This sound has ruined a lot of voice actors' recordings. It has made lives so miserable you would have thought it was cooked up by the Umbrella Corporation, but the question is, what actually is this terrible, horrible sound? Well, it is what is called a mouth click. <laughs> So, question is, what is a mouth click and how do I stop them? So, the first question is, what is a mouth click? Now, a mouth click is a horrible sound that is often caused by a dry mouth. These sounds mainly consist of little bubbles of saliva being burst in your mouth, making a very small and sharp popping or clicking noise. These are generally just very unpleasant to listen to, and it is not something clients want to find in auditions or in fully submitted work. They can often occur when speaking, moving the tongue or the mouth or the jaw, any sort of facial movement involving your mouth when speaking. So now that you know what it is, how do I get rid of it and how do I stop it? So let's assume a more basic scenario for now. You've finished an audition, you've listened through and you've noticed there are a couple of mouth clicks. Now one thing you can do straight away is use something called a D clicker. Now a D clicker does what it says on the tin. It will remove as many clicks as it can based on the settings that you give it. I'm going to use Adobe Audition for this example. So you can see here in the diagnostic section we have effect, D clicker and the presets. Now the presets are light, medium or heavy. Depending on what you choose, uh, the more severe it will be with its wiping out of clicks. Or you can choose custom and set the threshold and the complexity right here. You click scan and it will scan all the highlighted parts of the audio file and then it will show you where all the clicks are. Then you simply click repair all and it will get rid of as many clicks as it can. Now just a word of warning, it won't get rid of all of them. It will definitely nullify a few, but it definitely won't get them all. So it's best to prevent it before it happens. So how do you prevent it? Like I said, mouth clicks are usually caused by a dry mouth. And when your mouth is dry, your mouth will produce excess saliva to try and moisten it up. In doing so, the thick saliva is prone to creating bubbles, causing pops and clicks. So the easy way to do this is stay hydrated. Keeping yourself hydrated means your mouth will be nice and moist and your mouth won't produce that thick, clicky, poppy saliva that causes the mouth clicks. However, it is important to note you must stay hydrated throughout the day. It's not something you can do in the last few minutes. Also be warned not to overhydrate. Overhydrating may make your mouth a bit too moist, which can make sounds all on its own. An easy way to tell if you're being overhydrated is if you're just drinking too much water and you know you shouldn't. You'll know the feeling. Another slight thing that I've heard helps with mouth clicks is green apples. Now, personally, I have a big issue with uh, fruit, as my mother will tell you, so I don't eat green apples, but I've heard from many people they do help with stopping mouth clicks. Now, it is important to note that mouth clicks are not a disqualifying factor. They aren't the best thing to have in an audition or a finished piece of work, but if they are minimal, that's okay where they become an issue is if they are really, really bad. So if you have the odd, light, little mouth click here and there, that's okay. Not the best, but you know, it's okay. If you have a mouth click that could shatter the surface of the earth, yeah, that's bad. And that is a very simple overlook to what mouth clicks are and how to stop and prevent them. Now, this is a very short video alongside the other one that will be uploaded beside this. I just wanted to get a few more videos out for you folks based on the more um, simpler issues that beginners and other voice actors may have. So I do hope this has answered a few of your questions. And if you have any more, feel free to ask in the comments and I will be sure to get to you and answer you. If you liked it, please do click like, subscribe and share it with your voice acting friends. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.